Hello there, my fellow YouTubers. It's Cassandra72, and I'm coming to you with my Harris Teeter Super Doubles Haul. This is round seven for Saturday, June the 28th. So, um, just one store hit today. Um, just had a lot going on. I really wasn't going to hit it at all until those wonderful um, Evix came out. And anytime I can get on some tissue, I'm going to get on it. So, um, and I decided to go ahead and do that and um, go ahead and bring this to you. All right, you guys. So, a um, few different things going on that I had before. Um, I've done the Taipei again. They're $2.99, $1.50 printable, doubles, making those free. I was able to sign up another one of my email addresses for the Chinette um, Club and get two more Chinette coupons. Um, and so these are $3.39, I believe. No, they're $3.69 BOGO. Um, and actually, let's just let me go through the receipt with you guys. Um, so let me start with the Dial Soap, okay? Now, the Dial Soap is normally $2.79. And the EVIC for that made them 97 cents each. So you see that's two for $1.94. And then we had the um, $1 off two printable that will double, making that free. And you do see a total of four soaps there. And that was actually my mistake, which I'll talk about in just a little bit. Um, the popcorn for over Redenbachers, I have three of those. And um, they are three thirty-nine dollars BOGO. And this time I used a one dollar um, blinky that I'd had, so basically all of those were free for me. But if you don't have that blinky that came out a while ago, what you're gonna do is you're gonna use the 150 up to printable that you can get, and it will make it 39 cents each. So that is still um, an excellent deal. And there is an evic that you can load to your car for a dollar and fifty off of two, which will make it a dollar and eleven cent money maker actually. So. That actually then becomes better, but I've used that, that for this card. Um, the Angel Soft is what I was most excited about. So there are 12 double rolls. And this is ridiculous, I think, you guys, for tissue. It is no, They were normally $7.15. All right, so they were on sale anyway for $4.99. And I would have normally thought that was a great deal before I... Um, started couponing but um at 4.99 then there were they were actually had an evic for 3.97 so that became a great deal and then there is a one dollar printable that you can get and i want to say that it's on zip code 77477 on coupons.com that's a dollar off of one 12 roll um pack so 397 became 197 for each one of those so excellent deal um then let's see i talked about the china plates already um and then the toms so <clears throat> right here so this is new for me um i don't know what coupon to tell you they uh insert to tell you they came out of i can tell you that they were a smart source i actually ordered these coupons off of ebay um, these are on sale two for four dollars, so two dollars each. And then I used a one dollar and twenty-five cent coupon on that, which doubled up to the two dollars, making that free. I've already talked about the Taipei, and then finally my bare aspirin over there at three fifty-nine. And then there was a two dollar coupon and a recent um, red plum that would have made those free. And so in the end, I had paid nine dollars and ten cents, you guys and say 57.69 but i was trying to figure out where it went wrong because the only thing i should have paid for really was the angel soft so with tax only being a dollar and 64 cents i had like a six dollar and some cent subtotal and my subtotal should have been less than four dollars so i realized what i did wrong i got i got happy when i saw the dial and then i pulled out the dial coupon for a dollar off two and just was like, oh, let me go ahead and get two. Forgetting that the EVIC was only that I get two for 97 cents. So I returned them. Um, and that's one thing about me, you guys. And that's my tip. Like, if people, if you think something is wrong, don't leave the store. Go ahead and get it straight then. So I was like, let me go ahead and return these. So I returned those once I, as soon as I looked at the receipt, I realized what my issue was. 
So I returned to the two that I had um, purchased and didn't mean to and pay and they gave me six dollars back now so i paid three dollars and ten cents for this which should have ended up being i think about five dollars because i actually still had given them that one dollar coupon so i i think it should still balance out for them in the end but that is how i ended up coming up to a three dollar and ten cent total so if you guys have any questions or comments don't hesitate to leave them below i'll get back to you as soon as i can and until the next video, peace and blessings.